hi guys in this video i am going to show you that how you can remove add to cart button from your product page of shopify store so i will be showing you a few simple steps to add the style into your file and definitely if you are not sure about the coding still you will able to remove that button successfully so i will also show you that how you can change the label of the add to cart button because sometime uh, you will see that there are uh, add to bag or something like that so if you are interested to uh, change the label of add to cart button uh, then you can also do that uh, in some stores i have also seen uh, buy now uh, instead of uh, add to cart so if you are also facing such type of issues so i will be uh, solving all those things in this video so let's start with the coding part so you can see that uh, on this product page you can see that here we have add to cart button and below that i have also integrated paypal smart buttons so uh, let me show you if you are going to the uh, dashboard of your shopify store then you can see uh, when you will be clicking on themes then you will be getting this screen and here you will have the actions uh, option right so you need to click on edit code so once you are clicking on edit code then you will be redirected to the uh, files and folders of the back end so you can see that there are a lot of things over here but i am interested in uh, uh, removing the things from uh, the product page so here you can see that we have the folder of uh, sections so in some themes you will also get that uh, product template file in the templates folder as well but in this uh, theme we have in the section folder so we have the product dash template dot liquid so once you are clicking that uh, you will be redirected uh, you will uh, able to open the file and you can see that there are a lot of uh, code over here so what we gonna do here is like uh, we have currently uh, this specific button add to cart so i am interested to remove this one so first of all you need to right click this one and you will be getting an option of inspect the last option so automatically that button code would be shown over here yes here if still you are not able to uh, see this one you can also do something like this you can click on this uh, arrow button and you will just hover over this specific add to cart button and once you will be clicking on that you will uh, able to see that uh, code of the button so you can see that we have button type submit name add and id equal to add to cart so we are interested to use this id so you need to double click on this id and just copy this uh, id from here and let's paste that id uh, on the top of this specific file so you can see that if you have not added any uh, style tag inside of it then you have to uh, simply add here the style s t y l e open angular bracket and close angular bracket and then we have another uh, closing tag of the style uh, angular bracket open forward slash style and then we have the closing tag and here you need to paste the id that we have just copied and we have to mention here uh, hash symbol because this is representing the id and then you need to paste that id which you have co just copied from the browser so i have copied that one and now i am going to add some css properties and you have to uh, enclose that css property inside curly braces so these are two curly braces i have added and here you need to write here display none d i s p l a y colon n o n e none and then semicolon so you need to save this file once again and let's refresh this page so i have refreshed it specific button over here so once the page is loaded successfully then you will be getting that thing so we have paypal buttons here and above that we had a in a buy with amazon pay and on the left hand side we had the button of uh, add to bag and now you can see that that has been removed successfully right so this type of simple css you can add over on the top of the file and this will help you to remove everything uh, uh, remove that specific button all right so i am going to uh, I am going to remove this specific style 
uh, for a while because I am also interested to change the label of that add to cart. So for example, I have just saved and now I'm going to refresh this page once again. And you can see that add to cart, add to back button is back. So let me duplicate this specific tab and I am interested to change the label of add to bag uh, with the add to cart. So again you have to click on uh, themes. So once you will be clicking on themes then you will have uh, a simple drop down on the action button. So for example I am uh, clicking on this back button and now you will be redirected to this screen again and here we have the actions so once you are clicking on actions then we have edit language so you need to click on this link and here you can search specific label of the button so once this page is going to be loaded successfully then you can search here so here, here we have the filters so you need to uh, search here add to bag so automatically add to bag label would be searched here you can also see that we had this add to bag label so i am also interested to change this label add to bag with add to cart so you can see that this has been searched automatically and add to cart is uh, on the add to cart we had the button add to bag so if i am changing here add to cart so then i need to save this and once this translation updated then you need to refresh this page once again you can see that add to cart button is over here right so in this way you can simply uh, modify the label of the add to cart uh, button uh, just like i did so if i am interested to remove this specific button again i am going to uh, undo the those changes so let me save this once again and once this is going to be saved then you can again see that the button would be hided so once this is loading successfully then you will be getting that this buy with paypal or maybe other options would be on the center and the button uh, add to bag or uh, maybe add to cart would be removed from here so you can see that that button has been removed which was on the left side of buy with paypal button right so currently i am interested to uh, use the add to bag so i am again going to change that one add to bag and let me save this one and let me see once again so according to your requirement uh, you can modify so i have just reloaded the page and you can see that add to bag is over here and finally i am again going to undo that those changes and let's save this one and let me refresh this once again so once you will be refreshing that you will get that uh, the specific button would be hided once again so you can see that we successfully hided that button so i think you got the basic understanding that how you can hide the uh, add to cart button from your product page or even if you are thinking that you have that specific button on the home page or maybe uh, on the cart page or somewhere else so similarly you can uh, identify that which type of uh, uh, style you need to add so in this video i already mentioned you that this is really simple for you if you are not sure about the coding uh, coding uh, because i have only added uh, the id and then uh, added a single property which is display none which is just helping us to remove that uh, button temporarily temporarily means uh, you can also uh, again remove this css and that button would be appeared i mean visible so uh, uh, make sure that uh, uh, like this video and subscribe this channel as well in the next video i will be uh, coming with a new and updated thing and definitely i will be trying to solve some new problem 
so thank you so much for watching this video see you in the next one thank you so much for watching this video all the links of my video courses are below in the description which are absolutely free so in the next video we would learn new and wonderful things please subscribe this channel firstly to get the information of updated videos in the comment section you can write your feedback about the video and also write your queries if you have any have a nice day ahead